Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. So for today I'm going to be doing this makeup tutorial inspired by the one and only Kylie Jenner. So first thing I'm going to do is apply my face reflector. This is my face primer that where all the magic is going to start. So once that is on, I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Fit Me foundation in the color 322 warm honey and i'm gonna be using oh wait wait a minute forgot the most important part gonna cover up some um dark spots on my face using this new mark super conceal full coverage concealer it is basically the color of my foundation um but this one is just super super uh heavy or high coverage and i literally just love this Gives me that flawless face that I'm looking for. And I'm just going to apply that with an e.l.f. foundation brush. Alright, so once my face is looking a little bit more on the flawless side, now I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Fit Me foundation. This is the Matte and Poreless foundation in the color 322 warm honey seriously you guys i use this in every single video because it is my favorite 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 like maybelline maybelline just just hit it out of the park with this one i cannot see myself using anything else so now i'm gonna go in with my maybelline fit me uh concealer stick liquid stick in the color 25 medium and just use this to brighten up the face not really to conceal because i don't really have dark spots or anything um it's more of just a highlighter so as you see i'm putting it on my cheeks on my nose forehead cupid's bow and chin and i'm just gonna blend that out with my very dirty beauty blender just to let you guys know while i'm blending this product out i'm going to be doing my first fall makeup look in the next couple days and then after that i kind of want to start like a how to kind of um like series on my channel so yeah that's what's gonna happen very very soon so here you just see me applying like leftovers of my concealer onto my eyelids as primer now I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless uh, Face Powder in the shade 310 Sun Beige. And this is just an e.l.f. collection brush. I love this because you can use little product and because the brush is so um, huge, it kind of just guides everywhere. And it's amazing. Alright, so going back to those how-to segments that I am telling you guys that I want to start. They're basically just like instructional videos like how to achieve flawless coverage with your foundation, how to contour and highlight, you know, just stuff like that. So I'm like super, super excited for that. So now I decided that the concealer that I was using was not enough, um primer eyeshadow primer for me so i'm just going in with the urban decay eyeshadow primer potion in the shade eden i love this it's a nude matte eyeshadow primer and it just leaves your like it allows for your eyeshadow to be on all day like what better dream is that <laughs> All right, so now to start off my um, eyeshadow, I'm going to be going in with this Avon Blush and Bronzer Duo. So this one is in the color Berry Glow. And just with a really um, like thick blending brush, I'm going to take that pink color and just apply it all over my crease. Um, kind of in the upper half portion of my eye, just like crease and above, because that's going to work as like your peachy color. If you have like a peachy color, um, that would probably be better for you to achieve that peach and peach and gold look. Um, but just for like wanting to resemble more Kylie's look, hers is really like pink. Next, with an e.l.f. Uh, blending brush, I'm going to take that brown color and just put that directly into the crease, blending it all over. Um, this one is going to just work to kind of blend in the gold glitter that I'm going to be using. 
and it kind of gives a little bit more dimension to the eye which what person in this world doesn't love so now I'm just kind of adding more and like darkening it up just like so this is basically for camera purposes because otherwise I wouldn't really be applying this much all right so now to get that gold shimmery eye that Kylie rocks in this look I'm gonna go in with my naked three urban by Urban Decay um, eyeshadow palette. This is literally one of my favorite palettes that I own. Um, and I'm just going to take a flat eyeshadow brush and pick up the color Trick, which is just a really golden, really, it's actually really pigmented. Um, it's shimmery and it's literally my favorite color in this whole palette. Alright, so now I decided that I was going to wet my um, eyeshadow brush just to pick up more product and to make it like more creamy and pigmented. And also this helps with fallout. Um, I totally meant to do this in the beginning before I started applying the eyeshadow, but I forgot. So you can't really tell on camera, but I have a lot of fallout under my right eye and not so much under the other eye. So now I'm taking that brown color and applying it to the crease just blending it out and then I'm not applying more pink powder I'm just taking the same brush to kind of blend everything out and voila there we have it so now I'm just taking um my new favorite this is literally holy grail eyeliner it is an Avon eyeliner called super extend in the color black I love this it is precise liquid liner and I'm just gonna draw what I wanted to be a small little line I'm not gonna do a cat eye because I want the intensity of the eyeshadow to speak so I'm not gonna do you know my usual cat eye because with cat eyes for me it's kind of a go big or go home kind of thing so there's my little line now I'm gonna take these lashes let me tell you guys about these lashes. These are my favorite lashes. They are a mix of Ardell lashes from Target and um, Forever 21 eyelashes. You can just see how excited I am to be wearing these. They're so thick and so beautiful. And the glue that I use to apply it is the um, Duo Eyelash Adhesive in the dark tone. Now I'm going to go in and do some contouring. Yes, girl, some contour. Let me get some contour in this life. <laughs> so this one is an e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzing powder. I'm really just using the bronzing powder. This is in the color Turks Caicos. And if you've seen my other videos, you know how obsessed, like literally obsessed, I am with this contour powder. I'll just um, pick up a lot on the brush and just blend it out as I go and I'm just applying it to my cheeks my temples and my forehead now I'm gonna take this um, blush palette this matte blush palette by forever 21 love and beauty it is my favorite um, blush palette and this is just an angled like contouring brush by elf I'm taking the third the second and third um, blushes and mixing them, even though I didn't really show that I did that. Um, I did do that just because one of them is really bright and then the other one kind of dims it down, but they're still really peachy. Now, this is a new product that I just recently got. It is the e.l.f. Baked Blush in the color Peachy Cheeky. So, I intentionally thought that I was just going to use this as a highlighter, um, but then I kind of dragged it down just a little bit into my blush kind of just mixing it just to give that highlighted effect that Kylie Jenner always has so like I said I was just gonna use this as my highlighter but then I decided that this highlight wasn't as intense as I wanted it to be and I literally wanted to be glowing today so I'm gonna take this um 
e.l.f. Baking I Baked Eyeshadow Trio in the color Peach Please. This is literally, that gold one is literally all that I use ever for my highlight. I don't have, you know, a separate highlighter. I use eyeshadow and I'm literally almost running out. Happy dance, happy dance, happy dance. Alright, so now for my waterline, I'm just taking this Wet n Wild um, Colorcon Cold Coal Eyeliner. It's just a white pencil, and I kind of just want to go for that huge eye, that big eye look that Kylie always has. So I'm just putting that in my waterline, and then for under that, I'm going to take just regular black eyeliner. This one happens to be an Avon eyeliner, which is basically where I get all my eyeliners from. Um, and I'm just going to apply that under the white eye liner. Next, I'm just taking one of my literal favorite mascaras. This is the NYC um, Curling Brush Mascara. This is a City Curls um, collection or whatever it's called. And I just put that on my bottom lashes. Next, and the last step for this um, look, to finish this look, I'm taking a natural lip liner. This is more of like an orangey, like a dark orange um, lip color, lip liner. And I'm just applying that all over my lips, mainly focusing on the outside corners, not really so much the middle of my, the center of my lips. It's just to kind of give dimension to like the outside. Then because I am using a liquid lipstick today, I'm going to be applying some CarMax to my lips just a little bit. You don't want a lot. You don't want it to look like you're wearing lip gloss, but this is just going to work as like a base for your liquid lipstick and it kind of just blends in together the eyeliner i mean lip liner <laughs> sorry so let me just talk about this lip color this is the anastasia beverly hills uh liquid lipstick in the shade pure hollywood can we just have a moment of silence for this lipstick it is literally so beautiful and you only need a little bit, well, especially me, because this pale pink doesn't always look good on skin colors like mine. But if you want to rock it, go for it, honey. Just do you, boo. <laughs> and just like that, this look is complete. I'm so excited with how it came out. It looks so beautiful. Thank you, Kylie Jenner, for always inspiring the world. And, yeah, I have nothing else to say except i love you guys and thank you guys so much for watching and supporting see you in the next one Bye.